Okay, let's graph y equals x plus 7. And we're going to do a table of values to graph y equals x plus 7. You could use slope intercept form as well. There's a link at the end of this video if you need help with that. So we start out, we put values in for x, then we figure out what y will be. So I like to start with 0. So if you say x is 0, 0 plus 7, well, that's just 7. 1 is always a good one to put in here. So we'll put 1. x is 1. 1 plus 7 is 8. And I'm just making these numbers up, but I want them to fit on the graph. My graph only goes up to 9 here on each axis. How about negative 1? So if x is negative 1, negative 1 plus 7, that's just going to be 6. So these are the points we'll graph. So let's see. We could take and go to x is 0, y is 7. x is 0, y is 7. That's our first point. x is 1, y is 8. So x is 1, y is 8. 8, and then I said x is negative 1, and then y is 6. And you can see they're all in a line. It's nice to have those three points. Let's put a line through that. We could put arrows now, show that it goes to infinity. So you can use any values, and you'll get a value for y when you graph the x and y. It'll be on the line for y equals x plus 7. I just chose these because they're kind of convenient. That's it. This is Dr. B graphing the linear equation y equals x plus 7. Thanks for watching.